what's up dolls and welcome back to my channel and in today's video i'm actually doing a story time i have not done a story time since like i started my channel give me one second but like i was saying i haven't done a story time since like the beginning of my channel stages so this is just like very new to my channel but today i'll be telling a story about how my card got stolen at work and somebody spent over a thousand dollars on my card <clears throat> okay so let me tell you let me let me start from the beginning okay so as you guys know if you don't know i work at a store called charlotte Ruse at my local mall and i am a i'm mainly a cashier sometimes i work um shoes and dressing rooms and stuff, but i'm mainly a cashier and so when you go into work, the first thing you do is you clock in, you go to the back, you get your key, you get your headset, and you put your things in your locker. And you lock it. That's where I, number one, messed up. I did not lock my locker. I forgot. I don't know how I forgot, but I today, I, well, not today, but that day I forgot to do it. So I'm working. Now, remind you at Charlotte Roos, if you're not like a manager or anything, you only work short hours. So you work mainly four to like six hours max nowhere more than that so i was working a four hour shift from two to six so i came in a little earlier probably like 145 150 kind of like, you know get a little bit more time so i'm you know just there early one girl gets off at two so she gets up at two i clock in at two but again i came early so we're working together everything's fine or whatever just doing our daily thing i didn't go back to the employee part to like four o'clock maybe because i had a i made wigs and i sell them so i had a, a client want to meet me at my job to get her wig so we did that that's when i went back there and i was like oh wow i didn't lock my locker but my locker was wide open but i thought that was just me forgetting to actually close my locker so i go get the wig get her money we swap or whatever i put the cash in my wallet and i just lock it not thinking anything okay so mom had just came back <coughs> so yeah so think no nothing of it i go back to work so i was supposed to get off at six but what happened was a girl that works there she called can't come so i said i'll stay until you get somebody else to come because i want to go home so six o'clock still at work still working i clock out about 6 30. so i won't close i was back close from the store so so i go get some clothes try on some clothes which i have a, i will i will do a try on haul so soon i just I've been lazy, so I have not done a charging haul yet. But I'm going to have a huge one coming. I've just been buying clothes up. But anyway, so I went and got some more clothes, trying them on and everything. And most of the time, if you just getting off work or you're on break and you're trying on clothes, we get the big dressing room because we can open it up ourselves. So I get the big dressing room, trying on clothes. I go get another size on the dress I had because it was too big. Come back. It's two girls in my dressing room. I took my phone. But I didn't take my bag. So when I knock on the door, I go in. They was like, oh, didn't know it was somebody's room. They leave. I check my bag, check my wallet. My cash is there. So I'm like, we're good. So get to the register, got my clothes, buy them with cash. And then I leave. You know, that's not ordinary. So I start heading home. Get to the house making another wig just chilling watching netflix then my phone go off and i get a message like hold on it's kind of hot so i got <coughs> A uh, security alert saying that my car was declined at Walmart. So it's just like, huh? Ain't at Walmart. And then it was like, it got used at Walmart trying to spend $290. So I called the thing. 
Then I start getting more messages about Foot Locker. And I'm just like, hold on, wait, 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 wait. What's, wait. So I check my bag. My card is gone. I'm just like, them girls really stole my card. Like, they stole my debit card. So we on the phone trying to get everything done. They was just like, your current balance is negative $500. I'm just like, this, 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 this can't be. I'm panicking about the, I'm crying. I don't know what to do. I'm just like, oh my gosh. Go to my app while I'm on the phone. It's like negative $700 now. I'm just like, how is they spending all of this money off my car? How they get me into a negative like that fast? And then a woman's just like, oh, well, it started around 613. Now remember, I ain't get off till six thirty. So them girls ain't be in the dressing room since, until like six forty five. So I went into work with my car, but didn't leave with it. So I'm like, one of my did one of my coworkers do my car? Still don't know yet, so I'm not blaming none of them. But I'm just, I was just wondering, like, hold on, this ain't adding up. But anyway, so they was like, they they don't want the Zaxby's, fed off Zaxby's. They don't want the McDonald's, bought shoes, shoes for the kids. They don't try to pay a light bill, some everything. They done spent over a thousand dollars just doing so much in like three hours. And I'm just sitting there like, you really just try to finesse me, like. <laughs> Somebody really tried to finesse me just now. Like, they really tried to finesse me. So, I'm just stressed. I'm just like, oh my gosh. They're just like, it's going to take like a week, a week or two to get everything back straight. I'm just like, like, I had things planned. I got to do things. Like, what is going on? I'm confused. But, We'll be getting everything straightened out. And when everything is straightened out, I'll make sure to come back and update you guys. So I guess it'll be a part two to the story time. I don't know. But anyway, so pretty much I thought that happened. I was stressed. I'm just like, oh my gosh. I'm just, I ain't got no money. All I got is the cash that I got from the girl from doing the wigs. So I'm just like, okay, I got here from this these last three wigs I got to make so I can get this money right now. And yeah. But yeah, that's where I'm at right now. Just bad, bougie, and broke. <laughs> but anyway, you know, thank you guys for watching this video. That's really the end of part one of this story time. And if you guys wonder about my hair, this is my mom's wig. So yeah. <laughs> but yeah, trying out something new. You know, it's hot outside or whatever. And excuse my fr my room. My friend Robin is um, staying with me right now. But thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed the story time, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. If you would like for me to come back with more story times, I will. I have a bunch of story times, just never sat in front of the camera to record them. So let me know down in the comments if you want me to start bringing story times back to the channel. But anyway. Hey, thank you guys again for watching. Make sure you subscribe and become a doll. I love you guys. And this is Sin. I don't know.